New Orleans and Texas. Keith Mullen, Greg Swindell with you in the top of the first inning. Boy, I tell you what, the privateers got off to a great start. Triple, single, and then a two-run shot. The man comes up, gets a fastball over the middle of the plate, puts it over the left field wall, and the privateers are up 3-0. But it jumped out and then go to the bottom of the fifth inning. Texas trying to get back in the ball game, but it was 4-2, 13th time. Cody Clements has left the yard. Been doing a lot this season, a lot of big ones. He gets Texas going with a two-run homer right there. DJ with an infield knock with the bases loaded, and all of a sudden, Texas right back in the ball game, and then the ground ball fielder's choice by Duke Ellis, and we've got a tie ball game. Then Texas comes back, Zubia with the ground ball, Across the diamond, ball gets away and coming all the way around to first as Cody Clements in Texas has a 5-4 lead. Texas takes the lead right there. We go to the seventh inning. Just a hump back McGee, base hit to right field. Two runs come in for the Privateers and just like that, they're back in the ball game. They're back in the ball game, but now all of a sudden. Can't throw strikes. John Mark can't throw strikes. And then we go to the bottom of the eighth. Zach Zubius, 6-6 ball game, leading the inning off. Hits this ball out of the yard. Texas has a 7-6 lead, goes on to add another. And Texas comes away with the victory in game one, 8-6.